What's up, YouTube? Um, I wanted to do a review of my Ryobi Airless Paint Sprayer Model RAP 200B. I purchased this paint sprayer in uh, July of 2012, and um, I've had it for four and a half years, as it's uh, February 2017. Um, I've used this not a whole lot. Um, I used it probably five times, and um, after the third time, back in maybe 2014 or something, it wouldn't prime, and it was still under warranty. I had a three-year warranty on it, and um, I uh, had it serviced, and um, I guess the service center said the manufacturer wouldn't cover the, the warranty because they said I didn't clean it, even though I do. You know, I do flush it out with water every time I'm done using it. I flush it out with um, on the primer tube, and I flush it out on this tube. To give a quick overview on how to use the machine, um, here is your prime setting, and here is your spray setting. When you start the machine off, this is your intake tube. You set it to prime. And you put the into tube in here, and then as soon as water comes out of the hose, then you set it to spray. I have to what mop that up as soon as I'm done with this video. But um, after it was serviced, it was fixed. I, I paid $199 for it, and it paid for itself. You know, I painted I painted a five bedroom one bath with it in like two hours. Because I, I was replacing everything, the windows and the flooring. So I just went wild with it. I just sprayed everything. But I would I generally wouldn't use a sprayer unless you were doing like a really big job. Like three rooms or you're doing like a hard area, like a tilted, you know, ceiling where it's hard to get your roller in. But uh yeah, I made my money back on uh, two or you know, two or three times over. You know, it's still working, you know, it was a good investment. You know, you just have to make sure that you clean it real good. I'm about to pressure wash it right now to clean it up when I'm done with this video. But uh, I don't know why Ryobi doesn't make uh, paint sprayers anymore. I noticed that they discontinued all their models. But I would give this model for value, I would give it a 10 out of 10. For quality, maybe a 5 out of 10. Because it take, when, you, when you're spraying, you can't spray it continuous. So, you know, you have to stop for a second. You have to spray for maybe five or ten seconds, and you have to wait for it to stop for the machine to catch up just for a second. But uh, yeah, it's still pretty good. You know, I'd recommend it if they don't sell it anymore. But uh, yeah, I'd give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.